everyone, Sully here from Black Ops Toys coming at you today with an unboxing of this dude. This is ES, or Easy and Simple, so the SKU is going to be ES space 26047. This is one of their private military contractors. This is an urban operation sniper, okay? This is an unboxing, so let's go ahead and check it out and dig in and show you what's what. Okay. I've taken the liberty of taking the sleeve off, and this is the black box that says Easy and Simple. And it is easy and simple. So let's go ahead and dig in and show you the goods. Okay, so this is a two-tray system. This figure comes with a buttload of stuff, okay? First, we're gonna start here. I'm gonna start pulling stuff out. We're gonna kind of show you everything as after it's pulled out. All right, throw that yonder. Okay, so first thing we have, this looks like a British dude. If you know who that looks like, please leave that in the comments below. But I say British because he's got a bunch of British stuff on. Like this. This is the British, I believe, DPM camo. And it is a triple cell chest rig with an IFAC up front and two radio pouches. And it is fantastic. This would be a great piece of kit. Now, something cool that maybe you don't know is that if you want to use something like this, but say it doesn't match the color on your figure, you can actually paint these. I've spray painted stuff like this black and blacked it out, or I spray painted it gray, or I've done kind of a, a tea dye, which is neat, but you can still use this stuff and make it kind of any color you want. So this does have molly on the sides. Very, very cool rig. Next we have looks like a British jacket and it's got pockets all around because everybody needs pockets all around. It's got pockets on the sleeves and I do not know if they're functional. I'm gonna say no they're not. You can put stuff in them but the buttons don't uh, function because you wouldn't want them to because they would pop off and you'd lose them. Next we have a set of British trousers and then we do have a web belt up top and he does have a t-shirt on. And he does have some looks like Danner, old school Danner boots. And these are peg type. They actually have one of these, whoops, one of these feet glued inside. And then they wrap the leather around him and glue the leather to the actual insert, foot insert. So this will work with any peg style uh, figure or body that you have. So super cool, love these boots, had a set, still have them. They're in the garage somewhere. And they do see Danner, they say Danner on there made in the usa it looks like so super cool next they give you some feet and some hands because everybody needs feet and hands just in case you want to put a different set of boots on or you want them just to have regular hands for color okay next we have some gloved hands and this look like oakley gloved hands with the armored knuckles so super cool again super pliable great idea brian thank you uh you do have a left and a right okay so fantastic looking kit right out of the gate, man. So this would make a great, great figure just like that. Next, we have a boonie hat. And if you know how to spell boonie, please make sure that you do that uh, in the comments below. This is a green boonie hat, and I love the green color. It does have the molly webbing on the sides. It does have your water holes, and it does have your stitching on top. So super, super cool. Even has a little leather chin strap, because everybody needs a leather chin strap. And I don't want to lose this, so let's just go ahead and throw that right there. What's up, dude? Yeah, man. Oh, and there's a wire in there too. Check that out. So you can actually, oh, that's so cool. Nice, dude. Super cool. It's got a wire inside, so you can actually shape that if you wanted to. I'm just gonna do that, because that's cool. All right. Next, we have a bag, and this is a Mystery Ranch pack, and this is a backpack. And again, functioning zippers. It's got Molly on the sides, which is great and it's got a place for something on the rear maybe to hold something okay so really nice bag love it again throw some heavy stuff in there when you throw it on the figure now let's get into the second tray all right you got lots of stuff in here okay you got little string and it looks like that could be used for a myriad of different things and they do give you a patch okay and this patch happens to stay stay calm shaken and not stirred so that's a hint on who this is this head sculpt is based off of okay stay calm shaken and not stirred 
Now all of their PMCs come with a patch like this and they're all, all the head sculpts are based off of real people in the movies, let's say, okay? So very cool patch, like that. Lots of string, very cool. And it looks like this right here, it looks like a sight post, all right? Let's go ahead and keep going. So we have a couple of different slings, all right? So we got two slings and it looks like we have a sniper rifle. Okay. This is done in green. Looks like almost an olive green. And bolt does move. Magazine does come out. And stock does fold. Let's see. Cheek, cheek rest does pop up, which is cool. Just like the real thing. And that's it for that. If you know what type of sniper rifle this is, please leave that in the comments below. Let's see if you're right. Next, we got some goodies for the sniper rifle. Looks like we got a big old scope, which is nice, because when you snipe somebody, you want to do it from far away. That right there is sexy, super sexy. Next, we have a suppressor with a suppressor cover, okay? If you know what that cover's for, please leave that in the comments below. But you can see it's all tied up, super cool, and that fits right on there like that. And we like to say, like a glove. Badass looking rifle, man. Super cool. Next we have a bipod. This is spring loaded. This is a different style. So this is brand new from ENS. You can see the little spring in there and you can see what it does. So closed, open, bam, look at that. Holy Hannah. And this right here fits right in there like that. Super cool. Yeah, that's rad. And we can put it up, lay it out flat. We do get three more magazines, which is great. Can never have enough magazines, okay? And then I believe that, I'm not sure which sling goes to it, but you could probably use either or for it. Next, we have a set of sunglasses. Those are aviator style, looks like a smoke lens. Really, really nice glasses. ENS is knocking it out of the park with their glasses. Okay, next we have a dump pouch. And this is a pouch that you do not take a dump in, but you dump stuff into it, okay? And this is foldable, so you can actually fold it up, it looks like. And yeah, it would squish like that. And then somehow you'd fasten it. So this right here would probably go right there. Super cool. This is definitely like a black multicam pattern. I'm not quite sure. It looks like black multicam, but next we have a couple of these guys and these guys could fit on the chest rig right there. And it is Molly. So you got weaving in and out on the back. Super cool. Next we have, looks like a knife and scabbard. Okay. So knife goes in there. This does have a belt attachment, or you can put it on the Molly right there. Okay, so super cool. Lots of gear, man. ENS is like giving you a lot of shit, which is great. Next, we have some smoke grenades. This is red, this is yellow. If you put red and yellow together, what color does, does that make? Do you know? Leave that in the comments below if you do. Moving right along, looks like we have a pistol mag pouch, okay? And this is elastic, which is nice, but you just molly this on the rig or the belt and your pistol mags go in there. So super cool. We have a couple more grenades. We have an incendiary and then we have a flashbang. These are all metal pins, which is great. Oh, super cool. Two pins, because two pins is better than one pin. Fantastic detail. Moving right along, looks like we have a watch and this looks British. If you know what type of watch that is, please leave that in the comments below. And if you know what time it is, what time is it? Ooh, what time is it? Ooh, what time is it? It's right twice a day. Okay, moving right along. More things, there's so much good stuff in here. So we got a SIG pistol, two-tone, so silver on top. It does have a removable magazine. Slide does move and it is spring-loaded, so. Soup's cool. Hammer does move back, which is great. 
and then we have a couple of pistol magazines. Okay. Next, and we keep getting good stuff, man. This right here is a grenade launcher. If you know what type of grenade launcher this is, please leave that in the comments below. I'm saying that because I don't know the model number on this thing. So, super cool. Stock does pop out, does open up. Now these little things called grenades, 40 mic mics, throw that in there, slap that shut. Ooh, little sight pops up. So cool, so cool. Keep that high and tight, just in case. Another grenade, and then we have the creme de la creme, or the golden ticket here. Now this right here is an EOTech, and we got this guy. Now these right here are one of the most sought after weapons in the 1.6 scale field. And this is the newer version with a Picatinny rail on top. So this is super cool. If you know what kind of rifle this is, please leave that in the comments below. If you don't know what kind of rifle this is, then don't leave that in the comments below. Soup's, soup's cool, check that out. Magazine does come out. Looks like we got a buttload more magazines. And I would assume that you can put these in here, put them in there, put them wherever you want. And then we got a flashlight. Because everybody needs a flashlight. So lots of cool gear. And they give you four weapons. So sniper rifle, main battle rifle, grenade launcher, pistol, and a knife. So they actually give you one, two, three, four, five, six. Six weapons, if you count the incendiary grenade. One, two, three, four, five, six. Bam! If you want to kill some flies, this is the way to do it. If you like this video and you want to see more PMC stuff and you want to know more about this stuff, please make sure that you smash that subscribe button and ring that bell to be notified of new and extremely cool content like this private military content.